For the next three nights, we're gonna be trading in bus life for car camping. And I know what some of you are thinking. Do you guys even do bus life? Looking at you, Cheryl. We do that all the time. However, for this trip, we're gonna be leaving the bus behind to make our way from North Carolina all the way up north because for the next 30 days, we're gonna be living in downtown Chicago. I've been deep down stuck in the gutter I've been off the grid for days I've been lost just trying to forget her What do you guys think? Are you excited to car camp? Yes! Oh my goodness, we're almost done! Look at that coming together! Okay, we're gonna do a bit of redecorating and then I will give you a full tour. <laughs> but just so you can see the before, this is what we're working with. Okay, so remember this. A little before action. Okay, so actually it's too dark to give you a tour. You're not gonna get a fulfill for it, so we'll catch you in the morning. Good night. Good morning, Tink and Taffy. Tink. Good morning, buddy. <laughs> Good morning. You got your toys out this morning. Oh you look at the great big tent. So first night car camping was an ultimate success. Um, it was honestly like so cozy in here. We were nervous that it was gonna be too cold cause it dropped down to like 53 Fahrenheit. Um, but we had our top sheet, our duvet and a blanket on top. I slept in sweats and <laughs> what is this? And we were fine. Scott didn't sleep with us like all the layers that I did, but he was still fine. Um, the dogs cuddled us, kept us warm, and yeah, so we're just excited. This is honestly so fun. Okay, so last night we spent the night at a campground in West Virginia. Tonight we're gonna just be kind of boondocking. And so while we're here, make the most of the amenities, take a shower, because I don't think I'm gonna be able to take one today or tomorrow. Okay, we got some morning coffee from the general store. Uh, it was a Keurig that the shop owner did for you, and they didn't have sugar, so then we went and borrowed sugar from a neighbor, but we have caffeine. Cheers. Now, since it's nice and bright outside, we're actually gonna give you a tour. Um, a funny thing about this site is when we originally booked it, we asked that it's not a paved lot. Can we do a tent here? You know, is it gravel? Can we pitch it in? And they were like, yeah, you should be good to go. So didn't turn out to be that it wasn't the perfect spot so we look a little janky how we set up but it worked perfectly so this is the lot and it's like an rv lot with hookups which we didn't need and the only place we could find level enough that we could stake in was down here so this is how we parked we live by our own rules <laughs> welcome to our crib let's give you a tour so come on into the foyer We've got our little portable camper toilet here for all of your toilet needs. We have a little lounge area here where you can try your towels. Think about your life decisions. Follow me into the primary suite. Welcome to the primary suite. We have, you know, that kind of ancient style bed. <laughs> Inflatable. <laughs> but I meant like, well, I'm trying to make it sound fancy. We have, you know, that feng shui type bed. We have our ceiling fan, which is state-of-the-art, also doubles as a light. We have our screen-in Floor-to-ceiling windows. <laughs> Floor-to-ceiling windows. We have our dog's luxury bed over there. So it sleeps for? <laughs> for our Airbnb <laughs> listing. Right here, we have all of the doggies' needs. We have our- My blue... kitchenette. <laughs> Wait, what's the kitchenette? That's our kitchenette. <laughs> We have our Blue Eddy power station, you know, our backup generator. We have our own Wi-Fi router. And then, let's show you the hidden pantry. <laughs> so here's the staging area in Hidden Pantry. We have our projector surround sound system. We've got our bedding and our trash. We have our toiletries. We have our duffel bag for all of our goods. And you know, what more could one want than this life of luxury? Honestly, we love it. It's so fun. I also feel like we're one of those, you know, signs when you see like motels when they highlight all the fancy amenities and it's like kitchenette, high high speed Wi-Fi, cable, <laughs> cable. 
cable TV. <laughs> That's us right now. <laughs> On the road again. Second. One, two, three. On, on the, the road, road again. again. Just can't wait, wait to get, get on, on the road, road again. Already on the road. <laughs> Been treating friends. I can't wait to get on the road again. Day two or day three? Day two. Day two. <laughs> Okay, we just got to our second spot for our car camping adventure. It's actually a friend that we've made on the road through our travels and we stayed here last fall in the bus. So we reached out to them when we were passing through this area to car camp here. We love this place, it's special. Turn my way a bit, my way. Yep, stop, stop, stop. So the really cool thing about this property is it's obviously just somebody's house that allows people to park up, but it has a trail all the way around the property. It literally, look at this. It just looks like we're on like a hiking trail right now and that's exactly what it feels like. So it's perfect for walking the dogs. We're gonna do one loop and then set up the tent. <laughs> <laughs> Tell you what, nothing like a garden hose shower. That was the best shower ever after setting up the Five tent. Five stars. Yeah. <laughs> after setting up the tent in 89 degree weather, that was oh, It was perfect. the best. And we were so nervous. We, like, we sweat so much and we're like, oh, we're going to have to go to bed all sweaty. <laughs> no, we're new people. Bus life has prepared us. <laughs> Okay, night two, we're about to call it. The sun's about to set. That's the crazy thing with Camden is <laughs> once the sun sets, we just don't have light. I mean, like we have like flashlights, but I mean, there's not a whole lot of filming we can do <laughs> past that. So we'll probably catch you guys tomorrow. Also, this is what it looks like with all of the screens open. And Tank has found his favorite television spot. Tank was on TV tonight. Oh yes, it's squirrels are us. I love watching the squirrels, mom. Okay, leave me alone. Good morning from Ohio. We slept great. The temperature was like perfect through the night. It was like 68 degrees Fahrenheit. And it was really cool because we slept with this part open. And so you could see the moon kind of moving over as you'd like wake up through the night because we wake up every time that the dogs jump on and off the bed because it's inflatable. So when they jump on and off, you go like this for a second. <laughs> but now it's time to get ready for our next little part of the road trip. Look at this indoor outdoor bathroom. <laughs> Very much outdoor bathroom. <laughs> we have one more night. We haven't booked the place yet. So we got to figure out where we're staying tonight. Uh, but we're going to drive probably like three-ish hours. And then next stop, Chicago. So before leaving Washington Courthouse, Ohio, we had a stop at two of our favorite spots. One of them being Platform Coffee. Oh my gosh, their coffee is incredible. And the other is this dog park that the dogs obviously love. I mean, look at her go. And Tank is just being a good boy right there. <laughs> the bugs they're like singing their little sunset song we got sunset happening right here just took a shower at the campground showers and oh my gosh they were so nice they had like the showers weren't just these rinky dink curtains like we had doors that locked it was even a locked entrance into the restroom itself it was so nice and now i'm just chilling here with the pups while scott goes and takes his shower what do you think girl tanks just crashed 
as soon as we get anywhere, Tank just like settles in right away. <laughs> I think we're in the parade line. <laughs> okay, so we're on our way to Chicago and um, we decided to stop off in this tiny little town pl called Plymouth because they had like a cool thing to see here and it was this little town. We're in the parade line for this blueberry festival which is like the biggest festival in Indiana or something. Look at this, the entire town is here. <laughs> We're behind that little steam truck. Right, Gonna wave I to really everyone. Really think we're in the parade line. This is crazy. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> how, how did we get here? <laughs> well, why is there fire coming out of this thing? <laughs> uh, roll down your window. Wave to everyone. <laughs> Go ahead, wave. to originally see before we were in the parade. But look, I mean, it's a legit random buried Mustang <laughs> with wheels that move. Like, look at this one. Oh my gosh, it's halfway in the garage. <laughs> this place is so random. <laughs> you never know what you're gonna find. Gosh, I can see it. <gasps> oh. oh my gosh, we can see the city and we are getting so close. I was just telling Scott, I feel like I have like first day jitters almost, like that nervous feeling. Um, that's not nervousness, it's just like bundled excitement. That's how I feel right Exit now. Left. We're exiting! <laughs> Okay, I've left Ash at the hotel to look after the pups. I am driving to drop off our car. Got the e-bike on the back. It's about one and a half miles away. So we're gonna go park the car, store it for like a month or so. We've got in and out access, so we'll kind of use it maybe when we need to. And then I'm gonna bike all the way back. Okay, made it to the parking spot. Now I'm gonna unload the bike and yeah, get ready to hit the city. Ooh. For a second there, I thought I forgot the keys to the bike. So while Scott is taking the car and dropping it off, I'm in our beautiful suite. I'm so excited. So is Toph. Where's she at? My little Velcro dog. And I'm going to unpack here with the dogs and get everything settled. But what the heck? Like, oh my gosh, I just need to show you. I cannot get over this. This is like such a dream to be legit in the city with views like this. This is insane. And we're off. Look, even out in the parking lot, we've got a river right here. Oh, love city life already. Made it back. I think it was actually faster on the bike than it was in the car, because you don't deal with traffic. But we made it back to our place, and we cannot wait to show you where we are staying for the next 18 days in this place. So we are pumped. I got the grill up on the balcony. Wait, where? Ah! They want grills! Oh, yeah, look at that, they all do. That is so fun. You're going straight into wrestle mode. Oh, I'm so happy we still got a bathtub in the 